Hi everybody, this is Eugene O'Loughlin, lecturer on computing at the National College of Ireland and in this short video I'd like to show you how to embed a YouTube video into a Moodle course page. So let's start off with a typical Moodle course page. Um, I am the teacher for this page here. You can see the weekly outline has um, hardly any content in it so I'm just going to turn editing on. And when I turn editing on, I will be able to make some changes to my page. Now, there are three ways that I can add a YouTube video to my Moodle page. The first of these is to simply add it in as a web link. So choose the Add a Resource uh, pull-down menu here and select Link to a File or to a Website. And when that page comes up, give it a title. I'm going to call this a new YouTube video link. Um, I can add in a description here in this box if I choose. Um, but what I'm looking for is to link to a file or a website. So I want to, in this location here, link directly to the YouTube video. Now in my tabs up here in Internet Explorer, I'm going to click on, uh, on my already opened YouTube uh, video channel. And here we have a video about how to create a Pareto chart in Excel. So supposing I wanted my students to actually view this video to learn how to do this thing. Um, they can play directly or I can link it to them from my Moodle page. If I scroll over to the right hand side here, you can see I have uh, two lines of code which I'm going to use. The first one of these is for my link. So if I just select uh, the URL here, you can see uh, hopefully in the video it reads youtube.com watch with a code. So I'm going to copy that and now I'm going to switch back to my Moodle page and paste in the location of that URL of that web link. You can see it loaded in here. I'm going to select this in the new window and scroll down and save my changes. So I have now added in the YouTube link. I'm going back to my course page. I've added in the YouTube link. As you can see here, um, if I click on that, it will launch the YouTube video um, and my students will be able right. to play that there. So I'm just going to pause that and close it down. So that's a video uh, in YouTube linked directly to from my Moodle course page. Now, supposing I want to add something to that, I want to add some web content with a video embedded in that, or perhaps two or three videos embedded in that. So let's see how to do that. So once again, select the Add a Resource and pull down menu here, and this time choose Compose a Web Page. So this will be my um, uh, video in a web page. Um, I can give this a description here in my top box here if I choose. And this is the most important bit in this page here that I need, my Compose a Web Page option, which I'm highlighting here. And I've got an editor down at the bottom of the screen, which Moodle users will be familiar with. And I can now add material here. Here, I can uh, instruct students to watch this video. Or I can add in plenty of material where this fits into the curriculum and what they should do and what their objective in taking it should be. What I'm interested in doing now is actually adding in the video itself. Now, the one thing I need to do here is, this is a WYSIWYG editor, what you see is what you get, and I want to switch it to another mode. And if you look carefully in the toolbar on the right-hand side here, there's a button with two angle brackets on it, which allow me to toggle from this view that we see here to a HTML source view. So let's click on that. And you can see, um, uh, if you're familiar with HTML code, you'll be familiar with what this, uh, these lines here mean. And what I want to do is add in the HTML code uh, for embedding my YouTube video onto this, my new web page. So let's go back to YouTube for a second. So I'm going to click on my YouTube tab here. And the second of the two boxes that I pointed out earlier on, uh, embed, uh, is listed here. So I just want to select that code, uh, right-click, and copy it. Now move back to my um, Moodle page and paste the code I've just copied. And you can see there's quite a lot of it here with complex words and numbers and links and everything in it. And the good news is you don't have to remember all of that. That's just the code that will embed the YouTube video into this my new web page. So I'm going to click on the toggle button again to go back to my normal view here to see what this might look like. And you can now see that the actual video itself is embedded in my new web page here. I can add in a second or a third or multiple videos onto this page here. I can center this. I can add in more material here. Whatever I choose to do to create a web page. I'm going to have this opening in a new window, scroll down, and save my changes. So now I have a web page uh, which will launch here, and in this, my new YouTube video will be embedded for my students to see. You can see the play button there in the center for them, and they can run off and um, watch that video that you have made available to them. So I'm just going to close that down 
and go back to my Moodle course page. So you can see now we've got the YouTube video as a simple link and we have a web page that we have just created without any co programming or coding knowledge of HTML uh, on a web page for my students to view. The third and final way is supposing I want to have my YouTube video visible here in my course page. There's a f number of places you can do this, but the simplest thing to do is if you look at the top left hand corner, you can see a hand icon with a pencil on it which allows me to edit the summary for this uh, panel or this box here. So let's click on that and it'll bring me up an editor again. And this is very similar to the web page editor that you saw a few moments ago. The same toolbar is there and I can add in an instruction to my students to get them to uh, watch the video. Once again, I'm going to click on the angle brackets to toggle to the HTML and I need uh, the HTML code from YouTube. So just click back on YouTube, go back to the embed code here, copy that switch back to my Moodle page and paste in the same code that I pasted in uh, on the second example. Click on the HTML toggle source button to go back to see what this looks like. And once again, we get the YouTube video appearing uh, uh, in this editor as we would expect it to do. I can center it, I can add in more material and so on. So what I'm going to do here now is I'm going to save my changes and go back to my course page. And in my course page, right at the top of my page, where the students can't miss this, is a video uh, option with the play button here in the center, and they can actually play that video in the center of my screen. I've got my other two links there, and I can now, as usual in Moodle, continue to add my own, the remaining of the material. So that's how to add a YouTube video to a Moodle page. I hope you found this useful. Thank you for your attention.